Howdy my peeps. Today I am going to be showing you the process of a page um, for my comic that I did the other day. And um, I had mentioned this comic a while ago on here on this channel and I didn't say anything else about it I don't think. And I didn't post it anywhere um, until today. So it is up on my Instagram the first four pages if you want to read it and I'm not sure how often I'll update it but it's there and hopefully I will be able to update it sometime soon so that's a thing um, and the page that I'm drawing in the video is actually not even the pages that I posted so um, those will be posted later but um, I guess you get to like get a sneak peek of it and see them now or something I don't know but anyway um, this page here is one of my favorite pages that I've drawn so far I've only done like seven um, and I really like this one I like the colors it's well the, the color scheme that I chose for the comic is really like dull and just like blues and stuff and this is the first panel with a lot well this is the first page well the second page with a lot of orange in it and it just brightens it up and it brings more life to it and I think it looks really nice and um, while I was doing it I kind of was like I didn't know if I like the blue overlay that I was it's like a this green overlay thing that I've been putting over all of the pages to make them all look um, cohesive and when I was doing this one I just I didn't really care for it as much because the colors just look so nice without the green overlay um, so I decided to instead of using the same overlay for each panel to instead um, like when the environment changes use a different overlay and use that instead to make everything kind of come together and I think I like that idea a lot better because um, just the green overlay kind of especially the um, orange character her name is Jakari um, the green overlay it just it just kind of made her look really dull and I didn't like that too much but for this particular page it makes sense because it's raining so I left it for now but um, I will change that later, I guess, when they move to a different environment or whatever. But anyway, um, so this comic thing, I don't, I can't even remember what I said about it when I did talk about it a little while ago, but um, it's basically about this character, Kamir. He's a really pale fella there. Um, so it's kind of like, it's, it's Star Wars. I love Star Wars, so that's... If you don't like Star Wars, I don't know. I don't know how to help you. But anyway, um, <laughs> it's basically about him, and he's like force sensitive, and he's also too old to be trained as a Jedi. So it's kind of like me playing around with the idea of what happens to all the children and all the other people who are too old to be trained as Jedi. Um, with the exception of Anakin Skywalker, because apparently he's special and. He gets to tra get trained, even though he's too old, but, like, what about everybody else? What happens to them? So, this whole comic is basically me playing around with that idea and exploring that, and also exploring the idea of um, the Jedi not being seen as the good guys by everyone else in the galaxy. Um, because, I don't know if you're, like, familiar with Star Wars lore or anything, but, like, there's this group called the Separatists. They're, like, against... They're like the bad guys, and like the Separatists are against the Jedi and stuff, and like it, it's a lot, you know. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but it's it's just a lot. So it's just me playing around with the idea of the Jedi being the bad guys, basically, and stuff. And that's basically what it is. I don't know if any of that made any sense. I hope it did. But anyway. Um, so this particular page here is just Kamir and his friend Jakari sitting on a rock in the rain talking. Um, 
the at the, this point I have not drawn the part where like the conversation gets serious. This is just like small talk that they're doing in this the scene. Um, so that's a thing, and I really really like it. This is the last page I did, so um, things get um, cranked up to like three in the next one, I think. So that's kind of exciting to to like. It's just like an exciting thing to look forward to, to, to you know, like draw and stuff. Um, none of my sentences are making sense right now, and I don't know why. But anyway, um, my favorite um, panel is the one where they're sitting on the rock, and you can see their whole body um, because I simplify some things, and I think it just looks really cute. Um, except Kamir, he looks kind of freaky because um, I still like drew his irises but I didn't draw her irises so he looks like a demon but it's fine it's it's all fine but anyway um so Lizette turned out I like it a lot um I'm not gonna show you the words yet if you want to know what they're talking about you'll have to go check out my Instagram if you want to I don't know but anyway um thank you so much for watching I hope you don't mind if this video is kind of all over the place but it just be like that sometimes, you know? But anyway, um, if you like this video and you like to support me in my artwork, you can head over to my Threatless shop, um, or my coffee page, or if you don't want to do that, that is A-OK, -okay, my peeps. Like I said, you can head over to my Instagram, or you can start, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoyed the rest of your day.